Case of what authorities are calling human smuggling discovered in Morristown along the St. Lawrence River. Seven News reporters at Grady has details of court paperwork describing where it happened, how they got caught, and how lucrative the business can be. Normally used for recreation and shipping, these court papers say the St. Lawrence River was used earlier this month for human smuggling. Hao Chong Tran is accused of illegally smuggling three Vietnamese citizens into the United States. The court papers say on September 8th, U.S. Border Patrol agents, along with the St. Lawrence Sheriff's Department, received a call about possible smuggling occurring around Morristown. As darkness set in around 8.30 p.m., agents saw a boat drop three people off. As the boat went back to Canada, the three people loaded into a black Chrysler Pacifica and started west on State Route 37. A Border Patrol agent waited at a closed-down gas station until the vehicle passed by. Soon, two federal cars and two St. Lawrence Sheriff's cars were following the Pacifica. It was here, about a mile down the road, at the intersection of Route 37 and 58, where officers pulled the vehicle over to execute the traffic stop. Court documents identify the driver as Hao Trong Tran, who told agents he was a U.S. citizen naturalized in 2018. The court document states Tran lives in Rochester and is under home confinement with electronic monitoring. The three passengers, however, court papers say, had passports from the Socialist Republic of Vietnam along with Canadian visas. None had proper documentation to be in the U.S. When questioned, the Vietnamese citizens told authorities that the smugglers were going to be paid, in one case $13,000 to get them into the country. If found guilty, Tran could face up to 10 years in prison. Zach Grady, 7 News.